I'm Bruce Hamilton from News for Jax. A Jacksonville City Council member, along with the chairman of the Jax Chamber and a former Jacksonville mayor, are calling for the City Council to postpone an upcoming vote to remove a Confederate monument that's still standing in a Springfield Park. That vote is scheduled for today. The Biden administration framed its vaccine mandate for private employers in life and death terms in a legal filing that sought to get the requirement back on track after it was halted by a federal court. On the second day of testimony in a murder trial of three white men on trial for killing an unarmed black man, jurors were shown a picture of the shotgun used to kill Ahmad Arbery, along with disturbing close-up evidence photos of the 25-year-old bleeding in the road. And it looks like Jacksonville's iconic eyesore will survive for at least another month. News Rejects learned the planned implosion of the Berkman II, which was set for Sunday, has been delayed because of safety concerns. Hope now is to implode the building sometime between Thanksgiving and Christmas. The news continues on Channel 4 and NewsRejects.com. I'm Bruce Hamilton. Have a great day.